everybody, welcome back to Cottonwood Hill Farms. So today I figured I'd bring you along and kind of show you how we milk and how, how we do, uh, do evening chores. So I'm getting ready to head down right now, grab the fresh cows. Sometimes I get lucky and I can catch them when they're coming up to get a drink, but uh, tonight, not so lucky. So I gotta run down and grab them, push them up here, and then uh, I'm gonna clean and sanitize everything real quick, and then we're gonna get started milking. So uh, come along, check it out, and see what we do. open and it didn't even notice. Those are our bowls. All right, so this is the milk parlor here. <clears throat> Excuse me, we milk two cows at a time right here. And uh, this is the milking machine we'll, we use. Right here we can milk two cows at a time. Here's the babies out here that we're bottle feeding right now. This little girl right here, she, uh, her mom, three, two or three different nights I locked her mom up because I thought she was going to calve and she never did. And uh, then there was another day that came and I thought, man, she kind of looks like she's going to calve. And I kind of forgot about it. There was a storm coming. Well, sure enough, she uh, had her that night and I came out the next morning. That heifer looked about 50 pounds lighter and I saw some afterbirth on the ground but I couldn't find a calf anywhere in sight. And so I looked and looked and looked and I couldn't find a calf. And so we, <clears throat> she was kind of over by the railroad tracks when she had her and we just assumed that the uh, coyotes probably got her. Well, it was almost 48 or just about 48 hours later I come out that morning and uh, I see this little thing staring at me. So she walked she walked all the way from, I don't know if you can see, just up on this ridge right here. She was up on the other side of those trees on that ridge is where she was born. And she walked all the way down that valley and back up here and all the way up here. And I came out one morning and there she was staring at me. So I call this the miracle baby because she obviously got a good feeding for her first one, but then she didn't eat for 48 hours and now she's doing just fine. So.
that, guys. So you can kind of see how we milk there. It's pretty simple, pretty simple system. Bring them in through the uh, through the one door, uh, milk them. I sit between them, go back and forth on my little stool uh, that's got wheels on it, and then uh, take them out through the other door. So pretty simple, pretty straightforward. Our milking machine, obviously, you saw that. It's just a portable uh, two cow milking machine with an 11 gallon tank. I do have to stop in the middle and dump because it won't hold. I think we're getting. We're getting somewhere around 12 gallons or whatever, and I can only pretty much get about nine nine gallons in that before I gotta dump it. So anyway, that's uh, that's kind of how we do that. I hope you found it interesting. Um, I just uh, let the calves out, the bottle babies, and I see they're, they're jumping around. Well, they were. Anyway, if you found what we're doing interesting here, go ahead and give us a thumbs up. Uh, subscribe to the channel. We got some more videos that I'm working on that are coming out. But uh, we really appreciate all the support, guys. And uh, any questions, uh, comments, whatever, just leave them down below. And uh, we'll catch you in the next one. Thanks, guys. <laughs>